So how you doing my fellow DJs? This is uh, DJ730 coming back again. I'm actually doing this recording with my uh, camera and this is the Canon M50, EOS M50. Um, and I'm recording, if you're listening to like a fan going on, that's because that's from my uh, tower. Uh, I was gonna bring you part of the video but I prefer to show you it to you this way because the recording didn't come out as I wanted it to. Um, for some reason, um, I didn't focus. Well, it's not that I didn't focus, but I don't know if I didn't open the, the legs from the tripod properly. But you could see a weird, uh, like it was off balance. So I'll show you the video regardless. And what I'm trying to do now, let me zoom, let me zoom out. And so, let me zoom out all the way. So, now it's better, but I wanted to bring the image more to you. So, let me get this, bring it down. So, the camera. looking at it and if you can tell uh, the TV looks like it's crooked in the image and it's like I can move and it should be what is it there we're supposed to be straight. Supposed to be straight. You know, it's weird. Like I gotta learn how to tighten this. Does it look straight? <laughs> this is what you gotta do. There it looks straight. All right. So this is how you straighten it out which I did not do last time because I was uh it's my first time what can I say all right so I did half an hour but not half an hour I did an hour uh, so there's two videos if you could see it there let me zoom in there's two videos and that's half an hour uh, half an hour each so I did an hour with record box 5.4 it worked no problems internet on um, let me bring up the video just hit play I gotta cut the sound because if you listen to the sound then I get copyright strike so let me before. So, how you doing my fellow DJs this is so, DJ 730 that's me I am recording so, again, you see how crappy the video looks. That's why I'm doing another video of a video. Um, the software works. No problems whatsoever. Uh, but I only did an hour. I, I have to do at least six hours. Real test. Six hours. I haven't done it yet. But as soon as I get a chance, um, most probably this Sunday... I'm going to do six hours of just being, just being in the house, just playing with the software, playing tracks back to back, just practicing, I guess, um, and see if the software passes the test of time, meaning internet connection is on, my antivirus is on, and the software doesn't crash or doesn't give it a hiccup or something, you know, um, it's great software. As long as I have had my antivirus off and my internet off, it hasn't crashed. And I do six hours on Fridays and six hours on Saturday. I DJ at a spot, you know. And but I tested this one out also last week on the spot. It worked fine, perfect. But I haven't tested it out, like I said, with the internet connection on 
and the antivirus on because I'm afraid that it, it might crash, you know. And that's one of the worst things that could happen. Your software crashes on you. You know, if you're not skillful, that's one thing. But your software is crashing, crashing on you, that's another. Especially when people are enjoying your mixes or the songs that you're playing. So, I'm um, going to keep it short. I'm going to bring another video towards you so you could um, see what's going on. Let you know, there's a lot of stuff with Rekordbox. For instance, I've seen this guy do this video on Rekordbox on, you know, you, you, they say you have it set up in the way that you could just throw a song on top of it, even though it's playing, and, it, and it'll just play the other song, and then you go back to the song that it was before. That sounds cool, but me, particularly, that's not the way I DJ, and... I try to be careful not to throw a song on top of one that is playing. But Rekordbox has a setting, so you're not able to do that. For, for instance, if this song is playing, and you throw a song on top of this, it's not going to stop the song. It's just going to not accept it. You have to stop the song so in order to play the next song. You know, And that reassures you of not being able to make a mistake. You know, um, software works well. I like it. I love it. Um, like I said, I have my DDJ RX. Love the controller. And I have also my, um, what is it called? I just can't remember. It's still the right number. Uh, the, the DDJ XP1, that one. Which, that's the one I really use a lot. Believe it or not. The XP1. I practically do everything because it's just on top of my freaking computer there and everything. So, as you can see now, this is a recording that I was going to post. But, I messed up a little bit. So, um, I'm doing a recording about a recording. <laughs> kind of crazy, but it is what it is. And... Hopefully I could bring you more videos, more recording, more stuff. I am buying more gear for my DJ and recording, you know, so I could bring you up to date and let you know what's going on with um, Rekordbox. And like I said, Rekordbox, they're improving quickly, very quickly. I'm still using um, iTunes for preparing my music, but... At one point or another one, maybe I could just leave iTunes totally behind and just stick with the with the software itself. I'm sorry, it's um late. It's like one o'clock, <laughs> but I'm bringing you this video uh, very quickly, so hopefully you'll enjoy it. And unfortunately, I don't play my the songs. You know, you can look at the names and stuff, uh, but I don't play the songs because copyright you know once you play a tune they'll pick up on it and then they'll strike the video and you won't be able to post it okay but at this moment in time i tested it out for an hour um it's not enough time but it's enough time to know that it's better than what i uh the, the other version than 5.3 uh 5.3 which would crash on me when i have my antivirus and internet on um, or just my internet on it would still crash this one has not and it was fairly quickly like and I said I did an hour and then before that the software would just would just get freaking crazy before an hour if I have those two things on now it doesn't so uh, let's see what happens when I uh, give it a six hour run and if it works out or not I'll let you know I'll post it um, but it is a great software. Um, I want to get that little box that controls the lights because I have lights that um, sometimes I, I just want to take the lights with me, you know, and to make it a little bit different and more enjoyable. So let's see what happens. So this is DJ730 signing out. I'll be back with more videos, more craziness, um, you know. Peace. <laughs>